მოგესალმებით დღევანდელ ვიდეოში მოვუსმენთ 2019 წლის მეოთხე ვარიანტის პირველ დავალების მოსასმენს. იცით უკვე რომ ტექსტი 5 გვაქვს, თითოეულ ტექსტს 2 ორჯერ ვისმენთ, თითო ტექსტს 2 დავალება აქვს, თითო დავალებას 1 ქულა ენიჭება და სულ ჯამში ეს დავალება 10 ქულას გვაძლევს თუ კი რა თქმა უნდა სწორად აღვნიშნავთ ყველაფერს. მე მინდა რომ მოემზადოთ ახლა მოსმენისათვის საკუთარი პასუხები მოინიშნოთ, რადგან ბოლოს აუცილებლად შემოგთავაზებთ სწორი პასუხებს. ასევე გამოიყენეთ YouTube მოწყობილობის პარამეტრები, კერძოდ დააჩქარეთ ვიდეო ზოგჯერ ან შეანელეთ, ან ჩართეთ სუბტიტრები და ასე გაივარჯიშეთ. თქვენს ადგილას მინიმუმ სამჯერ მაინც მოვუსმენდი თითო მოსასმენს. რადგან მოვა დრო და თქვენ თვითონ აღმოაჩენთ ამდენი მოსმენის შემდეგ, როგორ მელოდიურად შევედის იგი თქვენს ყურში და მიეწოდება ქართულად თარგმანი ჩვენს თვინს. ასე რომ წარმატებას გისურვებთ, ნახეთ 2018 წლის ოთხივე ვიდეო, 2019 წლის ოთხივე ვარიანტი, 2020 წლის ექვსივე ვარიანტი და დაილოდეთ კიდევ ახალ ვიდეოებს როგორც მოსმენის დავალებებში პირველ დავალებაზე ასევე მეორე დავალებაზე და სხვა დანარჩენზე ამავდროულად გამოიწერეთ არხი გაუზიარეთ მათ ვისაც ყველაზე მეტად ჭირდება იგი მოიწონეთ თუ მოგეწონათ ჩვენი არხი რადგან თქვენი დახმარება გჭირდება ძალიან რომ განვითარდეს არხი და წინ კიდევ ბევრი გეგმა გვაქვს შედით მთავარ მენიუში და ნახეთ მეორე კლასიდან დაწყებული მეთორმეტე კლასის ჩათვლით დამთავრებული და აბიტურიენტებით დამთავრებული ყველა ვიდეო იმისათვის რომ გაიხსენოთ წინა მასალები თუნდაც სიტყვები წინა დადებები გრამატიკა ახლა კი დავიწყოთ მოსასმენი დააკვერდით წამზომს წუთებს და ყველაფერს გამოიმუშავეთ საკუთარი სტილი, შეადგინეთ საკუთარი მეთოდი, როგორ შეიძლება უფრო ოპტიმალურად გააკეთოთ აღნიშნული დავალება. ინგლისური ენის ტესტის მოსმენის დავალება. მეოთხე ვარიანტი. ინგლისური ენის ტესტის მოსმენის დავალება. მეოთხე ვარიანტი. Listening. Task 1. You are going to listen to five texts. For each of them, answer the two questions given. Mark the correct answer A, B, or C. You have 20 seconds to look through the questions. You will then hear the recording twice. Ormotsta metromete ormza metsxamete tsutidan itsqebs tekstis axsnas. Text 1. A young Georgian artist, Levan Songulashvili, has already gained fame for his works. His paintings are now a part of the Brooklyn Museum's famous collection in New York. The Vaughn became known to the wider public after two of his works called The Jellyfish and The Nun were sold at Sotheby's auction. The Vaughn's works had already been exhibited at the Brooklyn Museum for eight months when the museum management decided to make them part of the permanent exhibition. It's amazing that this Georgian artist's works are exhibited at the Brooklyn Museum side by side with the paintings of legendary artists like Picasso, Matisse, Van Gogh, and others. The reproductions of Levan's works are already on the museum's official webpage. The Brooklyn Museum is one of the largest museums in the world with about 2 million well-known exhibits. There are also Asian and African sculptures as well as examples of modern art. Many visitors wanted to see Levan's paintings, so the organizers decided to send some of his paintings to other museums in the USA. This is the first time the works by a Georgian artist found their place onto the walls of the Brooklyn Museum. A young Georgian artist, Levan Songulashvili, has already gained fame for his works. His paintings are now a part of the Brooklyn Museum's famous collection in New York. 
The Vaughn became known to the wider public after two of his works called The Jellyfish and The Nun were sold at Sotheby's auction. The Vaughn's works had already been exhibited at the Brooklyn Museum for eight months when the museum management decided to make them part of the permanent exhibition. It's amazing that this Georgian artist's works are exhibited at the Brooklyn Museum side by side with the paintings of legendary artists like Picasso, Matisse, Van Gogh, and others. The reproductions of the Vaughn's works are already on the museum's official webpage. The Brooklyn Museum is one of the largest museums in the world with about two million well-known exhibits. There are also Asian and African sculptures as well as examples of modern art. Many visitors wanted to see Levan's paintings, so the organizers decided to send some of his paintings to other museums in the USA. This is the first time the works by a Georgian artist found their place onto the walls of the Brooklyn Museum. Text 2 The Open University is a distance learning and research university and one of the biggest universities in the United Kingdom for undergraduate education. As it is a distance learning university, the students don't necessarily have to attend classes. Like any other university, the Open University can give you a degree. The Open University was established in 1969 and the first students enrolled in January 1971. The university administration is based in Buckinghamshire, but it has regional centers in 13 regions around the United Kingdom. You can attend one class a month, if you wish, at an open university center. Of course, there are exams to take like at any other university. There are a number of full-time postgraduate research students who live on the 48-hectare university campus. The students, academic and research staff, administrative, operational and support staff, can all freely use the Open University facilities for their research. The Open University also has its offices in 30 other European countries. The Open University is a distance learning and research university and one of the biggest universities in the United Kingdom for undergraduate education. As it is a distance learning university, the students don't necessarily have to attend classes. Like any other university, the Open University can give you a degree. The Open University was established in 1969 and the first students enrolled in January 1971. The university administration is based in Buckinghamshire, but it has regional centers in 13 regions around the United Kingdom. You can attend one class a month, if you wish, at an open university center. Of course, there are exams to take like at any other university. There are a number of full-time postgraduate research students who live on the 48-hectare university campus. The students, academic and research staff, administrative, operational and support staff, can all freely use the Open University facilities for their research. The Open University also has its offices in 30 other European countries. Text three. Taking young children to a museum can be a challenging experience for adults. Museums are designed mostly for grown-ups, though some of them offer special times for children's tours. During these times, the museum staff are expecting children, and they take them on tours which are specially designed for them. If a museum doesn't have a specially designed children's tour, children can still visit. But in this case, the teachers select about 20 objects they think are most interesting for kids to see. During the visit to the museum, the children will focus their attention only on those items. Then they will have to think about and discuss what they see.
So with just a little preparation, a trip to a museum can still be an enjoyable experience for children as well. Visits to museums should not be too long. Adults should remember that children get easily tired and bored, especially in the museum setting. So, 30 minutes is enough for children to view the pieces pre-selected by the teacher. Another 10 or more exhibits can be saved for future trips. Taking young children to a museum can be a challenging experience for adults. Museums are designed mostly for grown-ups, though some of them offer special times for children's tours. During these times, the museum staff are expecting children, and they take them on tours which are specially designed for them. If a museum doesn't have a specially designed children's tour, children can still visit. But in this case, the teachers select about 20 objects they think are most interesting for kids to see. During the visit to the museum, the children will focus their attention only on those items. Then they will have to think about and discuss what they see. So with just a little preparation, a trip to a museum can still be an enjoyable experience for children as well. Visits to museums should not be too long. Adults should remember that children get easily tired and bored, especially in the museum setting. So. 30 minutes is enough for children to view the pieces pre-selected by the teacher. Another 10 or more exhibits can be saved for future trips. Text 4. Alexander the Great, the king of Macedonia and the conqueror of the Persian Empire, is considered one of the greatest military geniuses of all time. Growing up, Alexander the Great had many teachers, one of whom was the Greek philosopher Aristotle. Aristotle admired the Greeks, their language and history. He spoke about them to his student, the young prince Alexander. Alexander also had other teachers who taught him that a Macedonian king had to be very strict but Alexander did not agree with them. When his father died and Alexander became king, he allowed every country which he had conquered to rule themselves. Alexander and his army conquered the entire Mediterranean region and even reached the Indus River region. He probably would have kept going, perhaps all the way to China, but he became ill and died. He was only 32 years old. Only thing Alexander wanted from the conquered nations was their devotion to him. It was Alexander who spread Greek culture throughout the Mediterranean region. In all his life, Alexander the Great never lost a battle, not even once. Alexander the Great, the king of Macedonia and the conqueror of the Persian Empire, is considered one of the greatest military geniuses of all time. Growing up, Alexander the Great had many teachers, one of whom was the Greek philosopher Aristotle. Aristotle admired the Greeks, their language and history. He spoke about them to his student, the young prince Alexander. Alexander also had other teachers who taught him that a Macedonian king had to be very strict but Alexander did not agree with them. When his father died and Alexander became king, he allowed every country which he had conquered to rule themselves. Alexander and his army conquered the entire Mediterranean region and even reached the Indus River region. He probably would have kept going, perhaps all the way to China, but he became ill and died. He was only 32 years old. Only thing Alexander wanted from the conquered nations was their devotion to him. It was Alexander who spread Greek culture throughout the Mediterranean region. In all his life, Alexander the Great never lost a battle, not even once. Text 5.
My name is Sarah. I want to tell you about a very special day that I'll remember for all my life. In 2011, my husband and I took our children to London to watch the wedding of Prince William and Kate Middleton. We got up very early in the morning. At 9 o'clock, we were already at Buckingham Palace. The wedding was at 11 o'clock, but the streets were already crowded. There were big television screens around the palace, and we watched the wedding service, which was held at Westminster Abbey. Kate looked beautiful. She wore a white lace dress and carried a bouquet of white flowers. Prince William wore a red jacket and a dark blue cap. After the ceremony, we waited to see the prince and his bride. Suddenly, we saw a procession of soldiers come around the corner. The soldiers were wearing smart red uniforms and enormous black hats. Eventually, the procession came close to the place where we were standing. My children were shouting excitedly. My husband was taking photographs of the celebrity guests and royal family members. Prince William smiled directly at us. I looked into his eyes and he waved to me. It was a fantastic experience. My name is Sarah. I want to tell you about a very special day that I'll remember for all my life. In 2011, my husband and I took our children to London to watch the wedding of Prince William and Kate Middleton. We got up very early in the morning. At 9 o'clock, we were already at Buckingham Palace. The wedding was at 11 o'clock, but the streets were already crowded. There were big television screens around the palace, and we watched the wedding service, which was held at Westminster Abbey. Kate looked beautiful. She wore a white lace dress and carried a bouquet of white flowers. Prince William wore a red jacket and a dark blue cap. After the ceremony, we waited to see the prince and his bride. Suddenly, we saw a procession of soldiers come around the corner. The soldiers were wearing smart red uniforms and enormous black hats. Eventually, the procession came close to the place where we were standing. My children were shouting excitedly. My husband was taking photographs of the celebrity guests and royal family members. Prince William smiled directly at us. I looked into his eyes and he waved to me. It was a fantastic experience. This is the end of the listening part. Thank you. Mosmenis davaleba dasrulebulia. Imedia uka moinishnat story pasuhebi da gordet zamsoms ramteni zoti guatsales dasrulebi satwis pasuhebi dasrulebi satwis axlav nahot shemutavaze bulis story pasuhebi te shega mozmat chweni zotna. Mas texti pirveli. Pirveli ta meore savatishia pirveli pi story pasuhe. Meore si. The ten alba chemchniet, meor de boda, musas menebits in a variant abyss. Me arva sahelebsus dat usminet da quintviton gamoid anet daskunat in a video abyss me had with mash. Meore texti, mesame b, meotre si, cahot story passo hebe. Mesame texti, story passo hebea, mehute b, mexe a. Me otre textis, sorry, passo here. Me should the B, merve C. The bolos, me who te textis, sorry, passo here. Mets rashi A, me at she C. Immediate maropili heart queni namushevarit. Tatu asiararis, kide gout to draw. Most minute minimum samger, tito videos. Gamuik and at Oela unari, rats gagachniad. As a begamoir and at YouTube mods or below bisquella shesad libloba, Taj carret tempis of Josokjur Shianelet. Charted subtit rebi, damisi michel bitat me a devnet text twali. As a rom, armat ebaski surrept, causeret s video, mas visat squella the Italian shirt de baiki. Da ertat mivart iot armat ebas. Thank you for your attention. Bye.